What is up guys, Mine Assassin Gaming here, and today we're looking at Concepts to Minecraft, yay, and this is a nuke we are looking at, there's a fidget cube, fidget spinner, and rocket launcher, and this is a nuke right here, basically it's stacked minecarts on top of each other, just like that, and to the limit, and yeah, when you press this button, it's basically gonna make a huge crater. Now, I will recommend saying TACTICAL NUKE INCOMING! So basically, literally it'll take out uh, your friend's house in one shot if it's not bigger than this crater. Look how big this crater is. You'll definitely get their house in one shot if their house is not bigger than that. Okay. Pretty epic. I gotta say. My friend Jake Snake figured this out. Uh, shout out to him. He does not have a YouTube channel, but just just uh, shouting him out. Just for the heck of it. He's also a helper of Snipercraft as well. Okay, moving on to the fidget toys. Right here we have the fidget cube. There's a joystick with a furnace and a minecart, and you can push it around. And right there, here's the buttons on the fidget cube. All the concrete blocks and terracotta glaze and terracotta blocks make the fidget cube a lot more cooler. So I guess you can make a really cool one. So you, this one's a diamond lux edition, by the way. So it's pretty insane. It also has a a, a shelf for storage as well. Okay, here right here you have a fidget spinner. I made a transparent one with orange rings. You don't have to do exactly what I did, but you can just make your own. It's like real life fidget spinners. Okay, right here we have the RPG or rocket launcher. Fire one piece of TNT pretty far away. I wouldn't recommend staying close to this machine or else you get blown up and die if you're in survival. So I'd rather step back when you fire that thing. So, yeah. I also snipe from a pretty darn long distance. I'm only using obsidian because you can do this in survival if you want. So, use bedrock as well. But I recommend using dirt or else it's not going to go that far. Because you need to penetrate through the dirt block to get to the TNT block to launch it really far. You can also do triple the power or you, you can just use as much TNT as you want, but I don't know how, what the rate, how much TNT you can light at once because sometimes the TNT will disappear. Okay, I'm just stacking my cards here, and once it comes, okay, and, yeah, there we go, oh, okay, that's not supposed to happen, crater crash right there, okay, so basically it flew that far, as you can see the crater, and it, that's a nice green, a few seconds ago, and, that's the RPG, that, that, that middle one glitched out in this one. Because uh, it puts a nice TNG on it, I guess. Okay, now, we're going to be showing you the concept of bottle flipping. Basically, all you need is a sticky piston, and a slime block, and a pressure plate. And you can bottle flip in Minecraft, you just gotta grab a bottle, throw it on the pressure plate. Sometimes it will glitch out, go behind you, or the side of you. This is weird, but if you do it just right, it'll land right on to where you're trying to land it. And if you if you threw it too far on the pressure plate, it'll go off the uh, target you're trying to land it on. Okay. Anyway, thank you so much, guys, for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.